Hey guys, Contact Alert 46 here. Welcome back to part 20 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Um, what? I just looked at my uh, my capture card, uh, or no, my Elgato game capture app right now, and I realized I accidentally titled this part 120 because I forgot to backspace the one. I just backspaced the the nine, and then I put two zero. So yeah, it says 120. But anyway, um, I can just fix that later. Meantime, I'm gonna go, and I'm gonna do the Skultula house for this, uh, area, I guess. It should be the last one. And the prize for this one is actually pretty worth it. Um, it's a big, it's a giant wallet, so we'll be able to carry 500 rupees. There's my horse over there. I don't think, oh wait, there is one more thing I want to do after this. Do a jam session with oh wait we can't do that anymore nah I'll have to do that later anyway Oceanside spider house let's see what wondrous things await us in here no oh, wait there. oh crap I didn't realize that there were some right here. Well, good thing we got this. It makes it way easier to get these things. Alright. Where is this guy, anyway? Like, there should be a guy in front being all like, Ah, I got cursed! And then kill spiders to relieve the... Oh, wait. I think he's in invisible. I think I was supposed to use Goron to get up here, but yeah. Hold up a sec. Oh wait, what? He's not in here. He's not invisible either. All right then. Uh, uh, I'm gonna have to, have to burn that first. I guess I don't really need this bunny hood. I can take it off and then equip something else more useful in its place. Oh, I still have to burn down the other one? Got it, alright. Pretty simple. Also, that's a terrifying face. In a kid's game. Is there something in here? Nah. I can burn this now. Fire arrows make things so much easier. Alright, if I remember correctly. Uh, there are some things you can find in those masks. I hope none of these are, like, invisible. That would be so annoying. Alright, well, I don't think any of these things are invisible. Oh, no, it just does that, okay. I thought for a second he was invisible, like, ah, oh, crap. Skull Skull to the Spider House. Really? Fun for the whole family. Alright. I'm trying to smash my face into that. So that. There we go. Alright. And I assume because that one's covered up by cobwebs, there's probably one in there too. There is so many spiders, oh my god. Because all you hear is this whoosh, 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 whoosh. It's pretty annoying, actually. Well, not really. I'm just being complainy right now. 
Oh, hey. I would not have noticed that if I didn't decide to just randomly use my hook shot. I was actually just trying to see if there's something in here. But I think in one of these there is. Maybe. Don't quite remember, really. Can I get that? Uh, I guess not. Before it disappears, there we go. Alright. Ah, you! And let's, you know, burn that down. That's almost a sure indication that there is one here. I thought, anyway. Okay, maybe in this small one. Okay, not in that one. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Maybe the... Um, maybe I'm not supposed to slam my face into these. Maybe I'm supposed to, like... Climb on them? Or not, okay. Uh, I'm getting some weird perspectives here. I'm hearing some in this room. Ah, there's one. Oh, wow, okay, you can tell which ones are which because you can actually see a hole on top. So these ones aren't obviously it because there's no hole. some really flammable cobwebs. I like that though because I hate cobwebs. Honestly in real life I wish I can just burn down my cobwebs. Oh god. But I feel like I, if I do that I'd probably burn my house down so that's why I don't do that. Yeah I, I hate spiders. I actually have arachnophobia in real life. So. Ah see. There is some things in here some of these. Yeah, like, I am scared to death of spiders. I cannot stand them. So, yeah, like, that's why if I see cobwebs, it's like, I wish I can just burn it down, because cobwebs usually means that a spider made it. Oh, you see? Hey, there's another one right there. You can die. I'm just glad Skulltillas don't exist in real life. Those would be absolutely terrifying because they're spiders, but with a skull on them. Oh, wait. Oh, that's not what that is. Oh, it's just this. Right, okay. Listen for these guys. Hmm. Apparently, there's still one in here. I just can't find it. Ah, there he is. Uh, if I can get him. There we go. Alright, can't hear anymore. It's a good thing those things are importantly loud, because if they weren't, then I couldn't tell where they are. Anyway, we can go to another door. Oh, wow. We don't have anything for these guys. There's supposed to be like a secret code you enter. Uh. Dang, okay, I can't... Alright, I'm gonna try to figure this out. Uh, I'll cut it to when I do. Alright. 
blue, red, green, yellow, blue, yellow, red. Okay. Blue. Okay. I figured it out just by trial and error. Surprisingly, it didn't take forever to figure out. In case you're wondering why this room sounds particularly louder, this is that. Uh, how do I get rid of that? Am I supposed to just like slam into this table or something? Okay, yeah, I was. Not really a good idea. Can I hopefully hookshot that one? Alright. Looks like I'll just have to leave and come back because when you leave, the spiders respawn. And. Yeah. Now he's alive again. So you can kill them, but unless you collect their little token, then they're gonna stick around. But anyway, we got 15. I forgot how many you need. I think it was like 20, right? I don't know if I want to kill these guys because they are, um, they are kind of passive right now. Matter of fact, those guys are supposed to give you the code if you have the captain's hat, which you get in the next area of the game, uh, kind of valley, then um, you can actually talk to these guys and they'll think that you're their leader. And they'll be all like, oh hey, uh, Captain, um, yeah, I'm just here. Oh, uh, you want the code? Okay, yeah, here's, the, here's my part of the code, because they each have like a different part of the code they memorized. But you could just trial an error. As you saw, it didn't take too long to figure out process of elimination. Oh, there's another. I'm just gonna burn it down just for the heck of it. There's no more to burn down, so I'm good with that. Now, I think you can take down these posters. which are just a skull kid. Alright, there's no, um, I don't think you need fire arrows for that. That's a stall child. They were the cursed soldiers of the kingdom of Ikana. What are you gonna do? Man, I'm just gonna leave them alone. Live and let live. You're not trying to kill me, so why would I try to kill them? There he is. Literally the last one. It's your 18th one. Alright, we're almost good. Good. We're almost done. What's this? I don't like you. Just die. Alright, let's see. Yeah, especially if it's, like if spiders were that big in real life, that'd be terrifying. Alright, so I guess you didn't have to do any of that for the specific side quest, but there is a piece of heart there, so that's good. So don't worry, like if you uh, if you don't I mean, I guess if you're watching this, you'll see the code. But, um, if you don't figure it out, then yeah, you don't have to worry about it, because there's nothing in there. Alright, so we're good. I guess we can just move on to the next room, which should just have the last five. And this last room, I remember, is just kind of like a library or something. Alright. And... These things are here. Alright, so there is a library in there somewhere, which is probably gonna have... Shoot, I forgot. Is it is it like 25? 20 or is it 30? I hope it's not 30, because that would take even longer. And uh, I'm trying to pause, but you can't pause while that text is up, so you have to wait for it to disappear. And then you can do this. A reason to come up here other than you know shoot that 
but that's not, I don't think you had to be up here. Man. What a good exterminator Link is. You got a little uh, gold skulltula infestation, uh, he'll gladly take care of them for you. I mean, I assume he does it gladly, or maybe he's irritated. But I'm making him do it anyway. Alright, so I guess it's not 20, because obviously 21's not 20. Before I go through that little secret room there, and I'm pretty sure it's not just a secret, I'm pretty sure you have to go through there. I'm gonna try to see if there isn't. Ah, there is something up here that we can look at. Can get up on these, uh, little, I guess, attics here. Yeah, of course, one of these has a spider. Alright. Oh, yeah, of course, I wanna be able to see if there's, like, they're inside those little cracks there. Because they sometimes may be. Well, it's not like they're coming from this way, which is through here, so let's do that. Let's... Ah! Okay, that's all the ones in here. It's caught and quiet, so it's good. That means we're making good progress. I think the library was upstairs then. Was there a door I missed here? Yes, there was. This is the one I burned down. Or the webs I burned off. Wow, that was laggy. Alright, so this bookshelf room is kind of like confusing a bit. Oh, hey, this guy. He has something to say too, but I can't talk to him again. A, it's like a haunted library. Perfect for your Halloween goodness. Some of these bookshelves you can push and some of them you can't, so that's what's confusing about this. Spin attack for the win. And some of these you need to like push in order to make them into platforms. So you know, there's that. Grab. You see, look. There's stuff like this. Like you wouldn't probably expect to do that, but what do you know? Oh wait, I can't. I can't push it that way. What do I do with this? Do I just push it this way? I guess so. See, so yeah, I see like there's stuff like this. That's very confusing. Not very confusing, but it's like you wouldn't really think to do that normally. Alright, so there's supposed to be a way to jump onto these bookcases. Maybe if I climb. Then run and jump. No, I can't. They don't have enough movement area to jump. Maybe if I climb on this guy's desk, then ah uh, no, so you don't jump off of that. And it would have been too far anyway. So maybe I am supposed to use these. Pretty sure you can do this. With There we go, we got one. Don't have enough room. Can't grab any of these. Or any of these.
box right there and we're kind of running out of time here I'm gonna finish this though because like, I'm pretty sure I can finish this I find it funny that the um, paintings of Skull Kid look like how he's supposed to look like in Ocarina of Time in the Japanese version of this game but oh hey I didn't see that guy up there but what should I call it? Um, they changed his face to wood because uh, the localization team was worried that having a black-faced uh, character with large lips would be interpreted as a racial thing. So they decided to remove it, and or not remove it. They decided to change his face to wood, but that painting of him was still in his original color. Dang, it's almost night. I better hurry up. Can I... Oh, sorry about that guy. I did not just mean to murder you like that. There's gotta be a way. Oh, are you kidding me? You can climb the shelf. Okay. Wow. Came around and murdered the guy for no reason because I thought I might be able to latch on him or something. And I didn't. I knew you couldn't, but I was thinking maybe that one. Oh, great. I'm gonna have to go all the way over there. I'm gonna do, have to do some Zelda parkour here. Carefully inch our way here. This should be the last one. You got the, the spirit. Yeah. Curse is lifted. So, is there just gonna be some like random guy at the front now that's like, hey, you uh, cured me? How do I get out of here? Oh, well, the same way I came in. Okay. I guess, I hope so, because I don't know where this guy is. And I'll just... I'll buy it up there. We're going so fast that we can't slide down. It would have been faster to go on up here, but, you know. Hey, there he is. I heard loud noises come from inside, and I was worried, but when I came to check it out... I never thought I'd find a place like this. Did you find this place? I beg of you, let me have this place. Not for free, of course. This I hope this would do. It's worth 20 rupees. I hope it's enough. But dang, if only I could have done... Are you serious? Are you serious? Well, that was a big waste of time. Wow, I I I'm honestly kind of mad about that. Basically, this guy's all like, huh, you, uh, too bad you didn't do this earlier, otherwise it could have helped you. Wow. Alright. Only had freaking 20 rupees. What a freaking waste. Well, there's one more thing I think we can do. I think I can forgive this episode being a little longer, right? I know it's an old habit. I said I wouldn't do it anymore, but just once. Because the whole band's here. So, before I change it back to the... Um, before I change back to um, Dawn of the First Day again... Um, 
I'm just gonna do this. Oh wait, we gotta set the stage lights back on, I guess. Whoa. So let's do that, like, really fast. Alright. Bunny hood. Alright. Running around at the speed of sound. Go. Uh, that's not the right way. Sonic Adventure 2. It was kind of a fun game, actually. Although I don't actually have it on my GameCube. I have it on emulator. But whatever. Oh, hey. Alright, these guys are here. Uh, light that up and uh wow they're all up here uh, and, and now. there we go now the stage is set right. can I talk to these guys how do you feel Maiku can't wait to hear you what are you doing? Everyone's already on stage. Hey, Mike, you don't hang around here. Hurry up and start the rehearsal. Late, Mike, hurry up and get on stage. All right. So my cow. Um... Just let me get on stage. Mike, you came back safely. That's good. I was surprised when my voice sound turned on, turned that lonely island into a turtle. But that song you played for me, my mother used to sing it often long ago. Those eggs were late to remind me of that. Wait, so was that asexual or something? Because I don't, or did Maiku want to remind you? Yeah, never mind. The song was from when I was a very young child, so I had forgotten it. I've put you through so much hor some horrible experiences, Maiku, but I'm all better now. Well, the co town's concerts very soon. Let's start our rehearsal. Oh, I didn't even get to talk to anybody. Two, three. And with that, we're ready. I can't wait for the town's concert. Okay, just one rehearsal. Don't need a like double check just to make sure you guys are up to par. My <laughs> God, I got this new song done for the concert. You did great, Mike. Who, and even without any practice, you really are a musical genius. Hey, Mike. Who, that song Evan wrote sounds just like the one we played in our jam session, doesn't it? That's because it is. Oh, I gotta do that. Oh, well, it's too late. Well, I guess that does it for this episode. I'm gonna warp back to Clock Town. And then I'm gonna... I guess I'm gonna deposit my rupees and whatnot. Yeah. And then in the next episode, I guess we'll do some bonus stuff. But I guess I got through what I wanted to do in episode 120. <laughs> Man, half an hour already. I've been up for a while doing this. I'm, I'm kind of glad to finally stop. Alright, you. You have an evacuated guy? You're an amazing little guy. Okay. Ah, yes, Link, okay. So... 200. What? You're really gonna give me that much? You're one rich little guy. What? It's this? You already saved up the thousand rupees? Well, here's your special gift. It. That's what they call interest. Right. You know what I'm gonna do with your interest? I'm gonna deposit that too. Uh, 
Alright, so... Uh, ah, no, 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 fine. Uh, okay. What's this? What do you need someone to do like this? Really? You're depositing two rupees? That's it? That ain't nothing at all, big spender. But if you say so... That's all I had, man. Alright, well, uh, I guess that does it. So, if you guys like this series and you want to see more, uh, stick around and I'll hopefully have them up sooner than later. But yeah, uh, with that, I guess, uh, yeah, check out my other videos too, like my playlist for Wind Waker, and stick around and see what else I have in store for us. Um, when it, whatchamacallit? What I have in store for you guys when uh, I make the videos. And there's one thing I just saw right now that kind of enticed me. I don't think I really have to do it, but I am. Actually, you know what? I'll probably do it. I'll do it. Oh, man. Here I am just adding on more and more time. Will it ever end? That's the question. It's probably like 50 rupees or something. Yeah, how did I know? I even got the number exactly right. I guess now that we're up here, we can finally see what's in this chest that's been here since forever. Alright, so yeah, I guess that's it. Um, so yeah, I guess with that, I wraps up this video. So, yeah, I'll deposit these and I'll end, um, after I end the video. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching and stick around and I hope you guys have a great day. And this outro was really bad. But I hope you can forgive that. See you guys next time.